Hello, my name's Trudy and I'm a tutor here at BritScent, here to welcome you back to another video. In my classes, I've learned a lot about K-pop. In fact, many students often ask me, do you know BTS? Or do you know Psy? However, this question is slightly incorrect. Today, I'll be explaining why it's incorrect looking at some other common mistakes and giving you some better alternatives. So let's dive in. So, the question, do you know BTS? Can you guess what the problem is here? Well, if I know BTS, it suggests we have met before. Perhaps we are friends or colleagues, Correct examples include, do you know a girl called Jessica? She works for the same company as you do. Or, who's that girl? I don't know her. Technically, we should ask if someone knows of BTS. This question asks if the person knows if BTS exists. Another example might be, do you know of any job openings? Or, do you know of anyone who is renting a spare room? However, in general conversations, we are more likely to ask someone, ah, have you heard of BTS? This has the same meaning, asking someone if they know whether something exists. More examples include, have you ever heard of a show called Emily in Paris? And, have you ever heard of an app called Clubhouse? Now, we can also use hear about, but only when discussing an event or situation which we have been informed of. We often use hear about to bring up a recent news story in conversation. For example, have you heard about the protests in the USA? Or, have you heard about the new Apple glasses? Finally, students should be careful when using no. We can know someone well, meaning we have a good relationship with someone and know personal information about them. For example, Tim, ah oh, yes, I know him very well. Or, I've met Ellie before, but I don't know her well. However, it's incorrect to use know well when discussing a topic. In this case, we should say know a lot about something. For example, oh God, I don't know a lot about cars. You should ask someone else for help. Or yes, I can help you. I know a lot about English grammar. I really hope that this video has been useful. Of course, you can get more tips on BritSense's Instagram page, so head over there and keep improving your English. Thanks for watching. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed our video, and I'll see you next time. Bye.